Okay guys, so I'm really nervous this morning because I'm going to try to milk mama for the first time today. I've milked a goat only once before and I couldn't get any milk out at all, so this should be interesting. I know, I'm nervous and I'm sure she can tell. <laughs> Just here for a second. I don't even know if that's a book as well. Okay, girl. She's just, there's so much slack for her to That's all right. All right, calm down, girl. It's all right. Come get your feet. There you go. There you go. Do you want to do now? Sure. Or do you want to do the other side still? I might as well go ahead and try that side. More. Yeah, there's way more milk in there. You need to keep doing that. Side. This side? Yeah. There's a lot of milk in there. That's probably the side. Calm down. She's trying to put her legs down on me. She keeps getting junk in it. Dog when you're bathing. Oh, there you go. This is for. Yeah, but I'm trying not to get it. I'm trying to get it under the legs, but I'm not under the cheeks. What most people do is they'll just. There. No, she's not going to do anything. You just make sure she doesn't try to kick on that back leg. Because that's the side that really needs to be emptied.
Is at least she'll start running. dirty. <laughs> Okay. How much do you think we got all together? Including what I spilled. Half a quart. That's not bad the first time. I didn't spill. I mean, you could have, you could have gotten a lot more from him. Yeah. And since they're not, I mean, you're taking two off. You may need to milk her this afternoon. You just need to wash her teeth because you don't want her to get, get too full of mastitis. mastitis. Yeah. Farm hair don't care. When I say that I've milked a goat before, I mean like I tried for like five seconds and I was like, I can't do it. I was at a friend's farm. We pick up, we get our raw milk from them and I was just kind of hanging out with them and uh, I was like, ooh, I want to try. So she got the goat up for me, and I like sit down, and I try it, and then nothing, absolutely nothing. So I'm pretty happy that I actually got some out, even though I spilt most of it. That is the remainder of our, of our milk, and then the rest is over here. Now, people... I have no idea what I'm doing. Like, no clue whatsoever. I'm super nervous. I think I am going to have to try to milk her again tonight because we're not putting the bucks back in with her at all. We're keeping Moonlight on her, like I said, so that should help. But seriously, she's like not really letting them nurse that much. So, And she's got a lot of milk. So I'm going to have to milk her again tonight, I think. And it'll just have to be a morning and night thing, I guess. And I mean, I guess that's the best way to do it. For me, I can get the most practice that way. But definitely, I'm gonna have to build a stanchion pronto. But, but right now, I gotta clean up this mess. I don't even know how to clean it up. Sounds like a farm. Oh, I gotta find the broom. <sighs>
Okay, so we kind of had a change in um, our farming dynamics. So um, when we got the goats, it was basically kind of mom's thing. Um, I'm not super, I don't know, I am not like a goat lady. I'm not, I'm just not really an animal person. I'm not not an animal person, it's just I, I'm a people person, you know? Since mom got Jasmine, She's been putting all her attention into Jasmine and Stella, and she's been um, just working with them a lot, just giving them a lot more attention. The goats haven't been, like, they haven't been neglected. They're just not getting, like, extra attention. So the other day, Mom decided that I should take over the goats, and um, because I don't have a job, I think it would be a good way for me to be able to make money for myself um, by selling the goats and uh, also I mean, obviously we're not going to be selling milk or anything. That's like way down the road, if ever. But um, definitely maybe we can start saving money um, and start drinking goat milk if we decide that we like it. Last time I tried goat milk, I hated it, so we'll see. But um, yeah, so I'm kind of excited. At first I was like, okay, like, just kind of, like I was willing to do it, but just not, just like, intrigued by it, but now that um, I'm like milking her and stuff, I'm pretty excited. But these past few days before I started milking her, I've been really just hanging out with her, just rubbing her down, and um, I don't know if I really said, but before when we first got her, she wouldn't let us touch her. She wouldn't approach us on her own. If we had feed, then she'd come up to us, and that was basically the only time. So um, now that I've been hanging out with her a lot more. She just comes right up to me, she lets me pet her. Anyway, so that's the situation. I'm kind of taking over the goats. Mom is gonna be able to focus more on Jasmine as much as she wants. Yeah, so we'll see how it goes. Um, we'll see how I do. And then um, hopefully I'll get better at milking and hopefully Mom will get more comfortable with me milking her. Yesterday I was rubbing down her legs, her back legs, and she wasn't minding that at all. She was just standing there. But anytime I tried to touch her udder, she would like, kick at me. So I knew it was going to be difficult this morning when we milked her. But um, since Mom was holding her for me, it really wasn't too bad. But once I get a stanchion built, it should be easier. Um, I don't know. I'll have to do some research on that and see how that goes. Hopefully it'll go easier, go quicker and easier than the chicken tractor. Because I don't want to go through that again. <laughs> I just rewatched that video that I just did and I didn't know I was focused in on the hay bale the whole time. Sorry. <laughs> Thanks for watching this video. Be sure to subscribe and hit that like button. See you later guys.